So I created a video on June 10th, 2019, that basically said, if you follow these steps, it will be impossible. In fact, I used the term bulletproof. It'll, your GMB will be bulletproof and uh, Google won't take your listing down if you follow these steps. I mentioned getting reviews. I mentioned setting up the website. And I went on to say, uh, you stupid bastards, you can't take it down. Well, the website was taken down. Actually, the website wasn't taken down. The Google My Business listing was taken down. And I seem to think I know why, and I'm making this video to show anybody who's interested in creating either a lead gen website or an exact match keyword like um, New York City plumber or, um, or uh, Tampa breast reconstruction, whatever keyword you want to use. I just want to show you the two things, the two reasons why I feel um, this GMB listing was taken down. Now, mind you, the website wasn't taken down, just the GMB listing was taken down. And in fact, it may have been taken down and the people just didn't respond yet and they didn't, they didn't protest uh, their listing being removed. So by the time you watch this video, it may, be, it may come back up. But right now, the GMB listing is down. Uh, somebody probably saw the video, got a couple of friends, uh, clicked that this isn't a suggested an edit, that this isn't a real business. Google saw three, four, five of those um, um, uh, requests coming through and took down the GMB listing. That's really all it takes. Uh, so let me show you how to reinforce it a little bit. I saw two things on the website where I believe if they were done, it would have been harder for GMB to take it down. So let's get to it. So if on Monday, June 10th, 2019, you were to type in breast augmentation NYC or liposuction, tummy tuck NYC, any of the keywords you see circled, the website liposuction, tummy tuck, breast augmentation, NYC would have come in, would have come up, whatever it was called, something like that. I have it's the one that I have circled. So there's a couple of problems, as I see at least. I see a couple of problems that I didn't see on Monday. Um, so let me show you the two problems. This is going to be a short video. So here's why the listing, I believe, got taken down. So if you type in the keyword today, breast augmentation NYC, and you went to the Google 3-pack, for example, if you typed on this fella, Dr. Nicholas Vendema, Vendema, and you went to the website, You'll notice if you went to the about, about Dr. Vendema, you'll notice his picture. And if I back out of this, and you went to the next one, Adam Krolka, you'll notice his picture too. And if you go to his website, you'll notice his picture. So here we go about Dr. Kolker. There's his picture. If you're creating a GMB listing, that's a lead gen site, you need to put a picture on that website and you need to write about that person. If it's for you, you need to take a picture of yourself and you need to write a little 500 words, 250 words about, about you. Now, if it's for a lead gen website, you could do one of two things. That depends on you. You could uh, put a picture in there and write about this certain person or whoever you sell it to you could write about that person and just swap out the information so you put John Smith in there you write 250 words about John John Smith at the end of the month John Smith doesn't pay you you send it over to Tom Jones he wants to pay for it and you put his picture and you swap out the text and put his text about it but if it goes under manual review meaning if somebody from Google comes to this website and looks, it's obvious this is a lead gen website 
or it's for somebody just trying to get leads as a second website. Why is that? There's no picture, there's nothing specific, and the other thing on the bottom is there's no address. So you're going to need to put an address of the GMB in the website. You're going to need to do that. It's going to get taken down sooner or later. Sooner or later, it's going to be taken down. Uh, somebody asked me the other day. Uh, let me see, rock stars. Go to GMB Rock Stars and speak to my friend Daniel over at GMB Rock Stars. You don't have to say I sent sent you. I don't get a, I don't get any kickback or anything like that. But just go to GMB Rockstar, speak to Daniel, and you can get your GMBs there. And the good thing about him is that um, he does not do phone verifications. He does postcard verifications. It appears that phone verifications are being uh, are, are have more like are more likely to be messed with and be taken down. And this liposuction may have been a phone verification. Right now, also, they may have just taken it down. Google may have just taken the, the GMB listing down, sent, sent um, this company an email, and they haven't gotten to it to protest the removal yet. And it may be up by the time you watch this video. Okay, but I'm just saying you have to make this look real. If uh, somebody manually goes through this, you don't have any doctor on it. There's no pictures of people. There's nothing specific. And if you go to the contact us, there's no address. All right? So you're going to need to add those two things. Like I said, go see my buddy Daniel over at GMB Rockstars. He could set you up with uh, some GMBs, some good GMBs. Uh, his GMBs to this point, I haven't seen I haven't seen them have any problems. I haven't seen any of them taken down. Like I said, on Monday when I made this video, I did not, uh, I said this wasn't my client, but I kind of bragged a bit and said it was bulletproof. And I said, you stupid bastards, you can't do nothing. You know, I learned my lesson, right? <laughs> All right. So uh, I hope I hope this website comes back because I was just using it as, as an example, but somebody got a wild hair uh, in their butt and uh, decided to take it down and all right, well, it's a learning experience. We learned why. I believe, it, once again, it's because of the, um, of the picture and, and the address. And I would have had more reviews, okay? They only had two reviews at the time. Um, try to get over 10 reviews. So thank you for watching. If you need help ranking your website, uh, please contact me at brettmaletta at gmail.com. My company's name is MindSaw.com. Also, if you'd like to please uh, subscribe and like this video and leave a comment in the comment box if I could help you, uh, please feel free to either send me an email or leave a comment and I'll be happy to get right back to you. Thanks a lot.